Hello, I'm Greg, the Uber driver. Today is Friday, October 13th, and I'm going to try to explain something so that even a six-year-old MAGA or Republican can understand this. I hear a lot of them and look at them on social media blaming the attack in Israel by Hamas on President Biden, that it's his fault. And somehow, if Trump were president again, that this would not happen. But let's get the facts straight. I know you all hate to use facts. Everything is fake news to you, but who is the one that gave Israeli secret defense operations information to the Russians, to Sergei Lavrov in the White House in 2017, Donald Trump did. And the Russians happened to be allies with Syria and with Iran and with Hezbollah and Hamas and the in turn, the Iranians and the Syrians provided information to Hezbollah and Hamas, and Hamas attacks Israel. Biden has given his support wholeheartedly, always for Israel throughout his time as a senator, vice president, and president. And Trump has proven that he will sell anything to anybody, that he is loyal to nobody except himself, and he talks about everybody behind closed doors, even MAGA supporters. So you all need to use your intelligence and realize Trump is not a friend to anybody in the United States. Trump is a friend only to himself. And this is not Biden's fault. If anybody's fault, it's Trump's fault. There you have it. Short, sweet, simple to the point.